said so far? Nothing. He's been asking to speak with you and only you for the last hour. That's all? Yeah, that. And he waved his right to legal counsel and he just keeps asking to speak with you. And under normal circumstances, God, after everything that's happened in Gotham, I figured, I don't know, maybe it's best to give him what he wants and just let you handle it. Is that okay? How long have those children been missing? Going on three days now. And you're sure it matches his M.O.? Well, that's what we need you to find out. If anyone's going to get information out of him, it's going to be you. Give me five minutes, alone. Absolutely. Good morning. I don't normally grant private audiences. Is there a specific reason you've asked me here? Well, it's not like I can shine a signal up in the sky or anything. You're a very hard person to track down, so I improvised. What happened to you? <laughs> Occupational hazard. Cute. Well, I'm here now. Speak. Ooh, I like that. The way you cross your arms and stand there all heroic. Do you work out? There are five children missing, Joker. Where are they? What children? Don't play dumb with me. I did my homework on you. I know all about you. The hospital, the boats, the murders. I'll crush your skull before I let you do the same here. Is that a threat? Ah! Clearly, you didn't study hard enough. Because if I did, I'd be the first to tell you. In this case, I didn't kidnap anybody. <laughs> tell the truth. <coughs> of course I am. What do you think I am, crazy? Don't answer that. Then if it wasn't you, who was it? And more importantly, why are you here? You know, Batman had his fair share of copycats. I know I killed a few. Did the thought ever occur to you that maybe Metropolis has its own prankster? You still didn't answer my other question. Ah, yes. Why am I here? How esoteric. Why are any of us here, for that matter? <laughs> answer me! Now! <laughs> yeah. Come on. Come on, show me what you can do. Come on, show me. What? Show me your powers. I want to see them. I want Don't to push me. What, you think I'm scared of you? Come on, hit me! Come on, hit me! I'm done with you. That's it? That's all you're gonna do? Come on! Hit me! No. That's what I thought. Ah, oh, it must drive you crazy to know that you can't. No matter what I do, or who I do it to, you can't. What? The media thinks that you're some alien from a distant planet. And though they might be right, you weren't raised there, were you? No, no, no. Judging from your clean-cut Boy Scout persona, I'm guessing you grew up here. Someplace homey. Where they gave you good, strong values. And that is going to be your biggest weakness. You see, you can't afford to lose control, and you know it. A man who can bench press an 18-wheeler and fly faster than a speeding bullet usually doesn't go very far without attracting a lot of attention. In your case, the world. Is that why you asked for me? To warn me? How thoughtful. Are you finished? Because I'm sure the DA is ready to bring you to arraignment now. Do you have a loved one, Superman? Choose your next few words very carefully. What would you do, man? This is completely hypothetical. Let's say someone were to intentionally murder your entire family. I mean, where does the Superman draw his line? I'm not telling you what you want to hear, Joker. I'm through with you. The next time I see you, you'll have a needle in your arm. Not if they bring me back to Gotham where I'm wanted. You see, I haven't done anything here yet. And at the end of the day, you know, 
They'll just lock me up again. And I'll escape again. But maybe this time, I'll spend my free time getting to know you better. I seriously got dressed like this 24-7 in the way the economy is. Rent must be crazy. And that makes me wonder. What does the Superman do when he's not Superman? Does he have a girlfriend? Stop talking. I'd say yes. <laughs> does she even know? What would you do if I gave her a smile like mine? <laughs> say? I'm a Boy Scout. I know you are. <clears throat> but pretty soon, the whole world will too. That whole tough act you opened up with, the skull crushing bit, it's gonna go fast. And then what will you have left with all your strength? How will you keep order when no one fears you? You can't be everywhere at once. That's for me. I don't have to be. I just have to be in the one place you don't want me to find. And once I get there, she and I are going to have a few laughs at your expense. You better pray that day never happens. You kidding? I live for it, and I'll die laughing from it. You can go now. Oh, and um, I'd like to speak to my lawyer, please. Hello, Mr. J. What kept you? 